What is up, ladies and gentlemen? I'm Laughing Coyote. This is Cricket 19 Predicts IPL fixture number 41. It's CSK versus Mumbai Indians. CSK is pretty much out of this year's IPL now. It is not looking good for him. It's Dhoni's last time out. And, well, he'll be leaving in the first round, which is uh, quite poor. And so, yeah, I'm going to make the career mode soon. Because now more than ever, we need that. Because we need Dhoni in action. And unfortunately, at the end of the first round, which is the regular group stage, we will not be seeing Dhoni anymore. But yeah, do let me know who do you think is going to win this one. And before we get into the game, do drop a like, hit the subscribe button, hit that notification bell to so get notified as soon as I upload. And also, do consider becoming a channel member as well. Thank you to everyone who has become a channel member already. Now let's get into the game. Charger Cricket Ground. Mumbai Indians have been doing really well. Chennai not so well. They would like to win as many games as r remains. I mean, obviously. So would Mumbai, honestly. I mean, they're not set yet either. I mean, they're doing better than Chennai, but they have not qualified to the next round yet. Rohit. All right, he's going to choose to have a ball first. Trent Ball to open a bowling for Mumbai. And Sam Curran to face a first delivery. Oh, he's tried to take him on. Tried to go into extra cover. It's just a dot. Thick outside edge straight to the field. And that's the end of Sam Curran. Gone for, well, zero five deliveries. It's been a very good over from Trent Bolt so far. He's given zero runs and he's now gotten a wicket as well. Good stuff. Curran not happy with himself at all. Wasted five deliveries, could not get off the mark. Shane Watson, there he is, normally opens. Well, he's opening today as well, if you think about it. It's still the first over. And there it is, that's why he should be opening, because, well, he's an absolute legend. Yep. Faf. Tried to smash it like uh, Watson did, but no, he just kept it simple in the end. And settled for the two runs instead of a boundary. Sensible cricket. Oh, that's a lovely shot from uh, Faf to Plessy. And an extra cover he goes. That'll be four runs. Straight over the bowler's head. Shane Watson. Collect another boundary. Two deliveries. Two boundaries from Watto. Just Watto doing Watto like things. Oh, there he goes again. There he goes again. Lovely. I have a feeling there's going to be plenty more of those today. Catch it! <laughs> like I said, I had a feeling. Just a feeling. Yes. All righty then, Shane Watson. Take a bow. 21 of 10, 220 strike rate that is. Fafulis at the other end have decided to take him on as well. Ten runs he'll move on to after that. Oh, that's a solid hit. That's going to be four. All the way to the rope. Oh, that's a cheeky shot. That's a very cheeky shot. 30 up in 15. 200 exactly now he's on. Shane Watson. Oh. Fielder coming under it. Don't think he's got enough on it to clear him. No, he doesn't. And the fielder will not drop it. That's the end of Shane Watson. The dangerous Shane Watson. He's going at 200 strike rate. And, well, he's gone now. It's an easy catch for Hardik Pandya. And Rahul Chahar strikes. Takes the all-important wicket of Watto. Um, but he you do next batsman in. He's got a hundred under his name as well. Oh, there's a fielder coming under it. There's a fielder coming under it. He hasn't got all of it. And he's taken it. Another catch. He gets another wicket. Good bowling from Chahar so far. rayudu has gone as well. Just one run he scored. Faf on strike. Oh, outside edge. He's got him. He's got another one. 
Chahar, he's on fire. That's three wickets for him now, but not a hat trick though. Apart. First, we're going to last over two here. Not back to back, unfortunately, so he is not even on hat trick. But it doesn't matter, because he's got three wickets, big wickets. It's really turning this one around for him. Oh my goodness, he's just got another wicket. It's the wicket of Jadeja. Chennai Super Kings. Oh my goodness. If it, as if it needed to get any worse for them, I mean, pretty much out already. I mean, they, I think they've just given up. I think that's what it is. They don't care. They know they're out. <laughs> that's it. That's the end of it. It's a lovely shot out of the gap all before runs. Tony picks up a boundary. Five of two. Oh, that's lovely. Goes into the same area as you got a boundary earlier with that same shot. It's got one here again. Here he goes again. This time it's Kedar Jadav. Don't he ask Kedar? He said, Udar. Same place you went. <laughs> oh, lovely. Between the two fielders on the rope. And that'll be four runs. Finally, a bit of rebuilding going on. Yep. There he goes again. Dhoni this time. Hardik Pandya has been given a treatment here that he might not really appreciate. Oh, that's a good shot. That'll be four. That'll, that's definitely going to be four. A solid hit from Dhoni. He has to do something big here. I think he's gonna. Yes. Oh, inside edge. That's gonna go to the boundary before. That's a fairly quick delivery. It's gonna be difficult to chase that one down. Oh. Outside edge. Okay, well. Yep. Oh, it's gone after him. Fielder coming under it. Has he got all of it? Has he? No, he's not. Yeah. And that's the end of Kedar Jadav. Got him. He's bowled on his legs. It used to be that you were supposed to avoid the legs of the batsman. And while well, it's completely turned around, now bowling on the legs, on the body, is actually a good idea. Because he'll get you a wicket pretty much every time. Here's Shaula. Oh, he's gone after him. Got a deep cover, but he'll beat him. Yes, he will. It's brilliantly placed shot from Chowla. First delivery he faced as well. It's looking really comfortable as if he's out there for 30, 40 deliveries, but he's only faced a few deliveries. Dhoni this time taking the charge. Four runs. Lovely bit of batting. 33 moves on to of 26 with that. There he goes. This is what I'm talking about. Look at that. Only nine deliveries. He's batting so well. He's timing it well, meddling it better than any other batsman. And Dhoni, well, he's not giving up. Not that easily. He's not someone to give up. Yes. Oh, shot. That's what I'm talking about. He's taking on risks, making it look effortless. Oh, that's a solid hit over cover. They don't have a cover. Or an extra cover, or a point even. Nah, that's the end of Chowla. First bad shot, and well, he's gone. Should have tried to hook that one away instead. Inside edge, Queenie took an easy catch. Chowla gone for 18. Trent bow strikes. Shardul. <laughs> yes, indeed. What a delivery. Boom. Got him. Off stump, uprooted. And that's the end of MS Dhoni. Just breathe Bumbra, known for his Yorkers, and that is why. Dhoni going for 47 of 38. Deepak Chahar is the next batsman in. 
Mumbai Shahar did really well. Let's see how well Chennai's Shahar does. One run at the end, 138 runs in Sharjah. It's, uh, it's very few runs, it's a smaller boundary. 138, they would have liked at least 20, 30 extra runs, but well, this is what they have. And they're gonna have to deal with it. Quinn Pindakukul and Raw hit, hit, and hit Sharma will be the next. Coming in at number one and number two, respectively. The Hitman and the Kukkur. <laughs> Alright, Queenie to face the first delivery from Takur. Okay, well, alright, that's uh, <laughs> it's quite a way to start. Oh my goodness, did you see that? A bit of extra bounce, it seems like there's a... Wow, okay, that was odd, never seen that before. It's a brilliant shot from Queenie, any extra cover. 10 runs, well they need a lot less than 10 and over, but I go on at 10 and over after the first over. And there it is, Quentin de Kock. The intent is clear, they want to finish the game off quickly. Ah, oh, take outside edge. Fielder not giving up the chase, he shouldn't, I don't think the ball's gonna travel, it does not. But I have picked up a couple of runs. And that's quite a way to get your first boundary. Rohit Sharma, boundary number one. How many more? Oh, straight into the hands of the fielder. No more is the answer to that. Josh Hazelwood strikes. Took a risk, brought in a short mid wicket. That's not something you see in a 2020 too often, but he's taking a risk. They need wickets and well, they've got one now. Surya Kumar Yadav. They've still got Queenie though. He's still looking as comfortable as ever. Putting them away with ease. There he goes straight down the ground this time. He is so good. Love watching him play. 24 moves on to a 13. There he goes again. It's too easy for him. Way too easy. It's child's play. Three back-to-back -back boundaries, and is that gonna be a boundary? Fielder trying to cut off, he will cut it off. Uh-oh, uh-oh, no, 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 don't, don't, don't. Oh no, I think that's gonna be a run out. That's a run out, that's a run out. And it's Quinton de Kock as well. Quinton de Rooster, gone. Gone for 30 of 16, that was just poor running. No need for that last run. Quinton didn't want it. Surya Kumar Yadav made him take it and well he's lost his wicket now. Ishan Kishan. Oh, no first lip. Yeah, that was very lucky. That's gonna go to the boundary for four. That was a fairly quick delivery, 140 clicks. Another outside edge and beats. The fielder again. Fielder not giving up a chase, but the ball have won the race. Oh, shot. Ishan Kishan nearly clears the rope there. Gets four runs, first boundary of the day for him. Oh, lovely shot. Very good shot. They're keeping up the pace, they're not slowing down. Oh no, 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 that's poor, that's too poor. Against the spinner, I mean, can't really afford to do that. You need a bit of pace behind it. Spinner's got no pace, well, not no pace, but not much pace, I should say. It's cost him his wicket. Trying to be a bit too cheeky. It's uh, the way cricket is played these days, I guess. Hardik Pandya. 
Okay, lovely. Quite a way to get your first boundary. There he goes again, he's liking that one. Why would he change it? I mean, he just got a boundary off of it. Yeah, yeah. So do you come out of love. He's like, you know what? I can do that too. Oh, a lot of elevation, which normally means not much length. And well, that's exactly what it means here as well, because Surya Kamariadov has placed that one in straight into the hands of the fielder. Same current strikes. Easy catch in the end, although it did go real high up in the sky, which is then difficult to judge as it comes back down. Surya Kamariadov gone for 18. Kronal Pandya, now the Pandya brothers are out there. Too close, but he's he's executed it well enough, well enough to get a boundary, that's for sure. They have slowed down now, but still they're going at a pretty decent rate. There you go. Going at a run a ball, and when you hit a boundary, well, you're going at well over that. Lovely shot. That's going to be four. That is four. Arik Pandya, it's looking good. Ronald. Oh, he's hooked that one as well as a fielder, but I think he's played it well. Yes, he's played it too well. That's gone for four. A lovely shot into extra cover that before runs as well. All right, the Pandya brothers are making light work of it. It's becoming too easy for them. They're just putting everything away. There's absolutely no pressure on their shoulders. That's the thing. They don't have to really do anything. I mean, they're just playing their normal game. That makes it extra difficult for the bowler to make the batsman make a mistake. Uh-oh. Well, there you go. They've made a mistake all on their own. But the field that was crap. Throw to the wrong end. Ah, oh, there it is. There it is. Addict's gone. Fun before he could get his 50. Gone for 44. Lovely take by Tony. Easy one. Not an easy one. Made it look easy is what I meant to say. Not easy at all, actually. Alec Pane gone for 44 of 33. A very valiant effort. Just given Mumbai a great chance in this one. Him and uh, Quentin de Kock. That's a lovely square drive. They've got a fielder on the rope, so he will pick it up. They're pushing for a second. That's a risky one. Okay, direct hit. That's always tricky. The umpire is going to refer it to upstairs to the TV umpire. I think he's gone. Yeah, I think he's gone. Yep, he's gone. When it's a direct hit, it's pretty much always out. Well, it's out in this case as well. Kieran Porrad gone for just one run. Imagine they'll lose this game from this point onwards. Need like a couple more runs. Oh, that's a good shot. That is a very good shot. It's cleared the inner circle and the boundary as well. Four runs. They really shouldn't be losing from this point onwards. Oh, that's a beautiful shot from Cole Tr Nile. He knows how to bat, I guess. Didn't think he would know how to bat. The kind of shots he's played has made me question myself. Two runs. Scores level. And well, no longer, because that's going to be four, and that's the game right there. Mumbai Indians have won. They've won it by four wickets. We came way closer than it should have been, let's be honest. And so that's what Cricket 19 thinks. Mumbai Indians are going to win. Do let me know who, what do you think. Who do you think is going to win the game in real life? Well, let me know in the comments down below. As always, if you enjoyed it, do drop a like, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell. Share the channel with others who have similar interests as you. They might like it as well. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching the video. Hopefully, I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, have a nice...